chatter and laughter filled the library at Woodward Park Middle School as students excitedly bounced from station to station playing homemade arcade style games designed out of cardboard boxes. And they're just having fun, honestly. They're just, um, they're making things. For the eighth year, Woodward Park Middle School visual arts teacher, Dana Stedman, and her seventh grade class hosted a cardboard game challenge inspired by Kane's Arcade, an event that requires the students to create games from recycled materials. Then, the entire school is invited to come and test out the student-made games. The idea behind the Global Cardboard Challenge is to foster project-based learning to teach math, science, engineering, and the power of creativity. Well, we were going to start with Connect Four, and that, it wasn't all the way functional, so then we came up with Plinko. I say they liked it, it was fun, because it was fun watching them compete against each other, and some of them tried to cheat, so that was really funny to watch them try, but we wasn't going to let that happen. We used um, popsicle sticks so that um, you could drop the um, bottle cap through, and we used cardboard, obviously. We learned that we have to stick together, and most of our ideas didn't work, but we worked through like getting together as a team, Gosh, I'm so proud of them because usually an art, an artist will hang something on the wall and then sit there quietly and let people look at their work. But this is a little bit different because they had to present their work. And I was so proud of how my most quiet students ended up really engaging with other students and having those conversations. They were very proud of their work and I was as well. 